We just ordered one of the Waymo driverless cars. It's going to take us to Old Town and drop us off to go have breakfast. So we're going to take you guys along for the ride. First time. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> when you order your Waymo car, this is a screenshot of what it looks like on the app. Uh, one way, it was more expensive than Uber, but you can sign up for a round trip, which is the best thing, and it's a reasonable price. There's our car. I'm not quite sure why it's parked all the way down there. We started our trip with a few safety rules. It was a little bit unsettling at first to sit there and watch the steering wheel turning all by itself. The need to buckle up is the same as always. So keep your seatbelt fastened, please. We had a little hiccup right after we started our ride. The Waymo car went over a dip a little bit too fast. We'll do all the driving. So <laughs> Uh, some frequently asked questions. There are maximum of three passengers in there. Nobody can see it, sit in the driver's seat. But every once in a while, somebody will be in the driver's seat, and that's a Waymo employee testing everything out. So um, a couple of the other things are you have to be over 18. There's no alcohol in the car, and uh, pets are not allowed unless it's a service animal. And now it was time to sit back and enjoy the ride. Once I got a little bit more comfortable with the ride, it was actually kind of funny to see the reactions of people that we got as we were going down the street. The bicycle is backed up. <laughs> <laughs> Almost there. Don't forget your belongings. The doors will remain locked when we arrive. Pull the handle twice to exit. The first pull unlocks. The second opens the door.
the Waymo car pulled up right in front of the restaurant that we wanted to go to and dropped us off. It sat there and waited for a little bit. We went to the restaurant. We were a little bit afraid that it wasn't going to move, but it ended up taking off. And then we called it back when we were ready. And it came right back. Oh, it's going to stop right here. A little uh, summary of our Waymo ride. Uh, very interesting. It uh, raises your blood pressure a first time doing it, having a car drive by itself. But definitely do it again. Uh, Waymo's owned by Google and it's going to be successful. I think it's uh, well run and well done. For us, it was about five miles each way and round trip was $18. So it would be great if you're going to the grocery store, doctor's appointment, or anything like that. It worked, worked out real good, and I could see us in the future using it for something like that.